Welcome back to Let's Play Stacking. I'm Burning Dog Face. And uh, Charlie needs to get these guys back in the club one more time, but we're not quite sure how to do that. Shout out to K.O.R. who says, It's such a charming game. The number of small household items they manage to make stuff out of is fantastic. And then adds, yeah, the correction, I, I was wrong earlier. I believe French honorifics are just M dot for Monsieur, for Monsieur uh, which is Mr. in French. Uh, M-M-E dot for Madame, which is Mrs. And M-L-L-E for Mademoiselle, which is Miss. So, uh, yeah, thanks for that. And shout out to Elthwar, who would also like to issue a correction. Uh, he says, I was tired and wrote almonds instead of nutmeg. My apologies, those are two different, two separate spices, in case there was any confusion about that. So let's see. Oh, I didn't even notice that. One of the hijinks is using the, uh... The adventurers, all wrapped up, use Professor Ramsey's to mummify dolls. And now that I think about it, Steward Season is probably using the, uh, the Hunter Darby to shoot at the guys in the white coats. What I actually came here to do was to get a hint for Get the Gets a Gig, since I'm not actually sure what the third option would even be. Some judge a book by its cover. What the fuck does that mean? Okay, fuck it. I'll just head to the top floor. Yes, yes, I know. Someone ate all the porridge, and you should insist it wasn't you. The far post in this fence appears to be a gold-painted pencil. Is the guy still out here? get into the guards, and they still say the same lines. What does this one say? It appears you did pass. The Baron will be most upset. Please, leave me to sour. Yes, I do remember that line. Hello? Anyone? Oh, I've just remembered that they were actually down. Fuck! It's been a few days. My bad. How embarrassing. I feel like I should mention that amongst these crates are just a bunch of straight-up children's blocks with letters on them. Yeah, they were actually hanging out near the, uh, the lifeboats with the Illusionist family. Who do you think keeps moving the bear back into that guy's quarters? I guess I can see the madame here, I think. Well, there's the Hunter Darby. Oh, wait, no, I actually need Ramses for a moment anyway. First things first. Oh, no, wait. No, Ramses is the, the size three guy, that's right. You're powerfully large, mes habitants. Your weapon is as long as it is proud. I measure randos. What if I measure the bear? Or this, uh, oh. That's weird. Pied Piper's hat isn't gold anymore. Ugh. Your eyes are too far apart. Rude. You do not measure up to adulthood yet. <laughs> I think I think I was clo too close to that guy. Oh no, it is just your eyes are too far apart, which is funny because this guy's wearing an eye patch.
He did went through the entire animation, including the speaking animation, but no word balloon actually appeared. I don't think they expected me to search the bear, or me to measure the bear. Which is funny, because you'd think that the generic line would have come up. Professor Ramses. Okay, let's just go ahead and do this. Because it has to be small people. Yeah, size two or smaller. Or wait. No, I guess size three. Maybe I should just go with size, yeah. Size two, and I'm size zero. Let's wrap Hans up. Maybe that'll slow it down for a while. Wrap up this steward. Just cover them in mummy wrappings. Where is a baby? That would be funny. If a bit psychotic. All wrapped up. My fez has turned gold. How wonderful. Some judge a book by its cover. What the fuck does that mean? I thought that was a way of saying, get them the makeover. Have I been the captain? Captain Swing. New award unlocked in the hideout. Oh, I got all of them. Nice, that was the last one. No, 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 no. Yep. yep. Captain Swing. Mr. Swing was promoted from the Baron's dinghy fleet to captain the steamship because of his willingness to follow orders without question. Oh boy. Foghorn. His hat flies off his head and he appears to have a rotating foghorn attached to the top of his head. Wow. Let's see. Your steward's kind of everywhere. Let's start with these ones, since they're wearing masks. Fire cork! Steward season. Hit stewards with a cork gun. Where is his top half? Oh good, it is coming back. Thank God. Missed. What? That was uncalled for, yes. That's why I'm not trying to hit you. It's a second one. It's a third... Oh, this guy was a steward. I didn't know that. I did get a good scolding after shooting a steam pipe, but as I am the only licensed cannon operator on board, there was little they could do. I live for the hard crack of the ball striking the animals. Hmm. I was just thinking to myself if the broadsides one has something to do with firing the cannon as the pirate. But he wouldn't fit in there. When he hits them with the cork, their top half flies off, rolls away, stays there for about three seconds, and then floats back onto their top of their body. And more like five seconds, but whatever. Blam! You're dead! Oh, what's the rocket raccoon line he trying to turn to do his catchphrase? Bang! I've murdered you! Yeah, that was the one. I will note the presence of the word tried in that sentence. As it's doing fa a fair amount of- wait, those are all stewards. I just need to hit one of them. Get back here, you biking assholes! Wait, they're on a path. What am I doing? <laughs> I'll just go this way. <laughs> Oh, that didn't even count. One more. I think there's a steward in with the... Oh, that's above me, yeah. Fuck. Wait. Am I just supposed to smuggle them in? Oh, interesting! It didn't count when I repeated that. I do have to find a different one. I'll go upstairs. Get off the wall, you fuck. Hi! 
the rifle, but not the cork, has turned gold. Or I guess the pop gun, in this case. All right, I have had the thought. So, I need to... Yeah, there's the coins, which means nothing. The brothers are not here. Fuck! I think I might need to smuggle them in inside another guy. Like, just grab one of these extremely wealthy-looking dudes and just go in. These guys here... Where did I leave them? Next to the kitchen. Or not. Well, I will find them. Wait, was it up here? I was running around up here a lot. Hi. It's reminding me that I got all of those. Don't tell my mother, but I had fun coloring on those towels. The growing up with a music player on his head yelled at us. And now all of the towels are gone. I just noticed that the box of crayons behind them, even though it's empty, has a picture of the makeover guy on it, the, uh, the French artist type. But how come Charlie's the only one in the world that doesn't get a special ability? Or maybe stacking is a special ability because he's a zero. No one seems to treat it as it, uh, uh, yeah, as at all unusual. Is what I'm trying to say. You know, without st uh, stumbling over my own tongue. God damn it, Billy and Bobby! Fucking page the Web Brothers to the front of the store. Oh, there they are! Grab a random tiny person, grab one of them. Now I head down here to grab some guy with a top hat. I wonder why the fanciest people hang out down here. Or maybe they're all wandering around at random. Ah, here's one. Uh, no, opposite side. Good thing those waves are only painted on, because, uh, they're really high. All tests passed, you are now the house band. Fancy facade! Ha-ha! There was some other stuff to do here, like hijinks and such. Rod sides. I never did figure that one out, but given that there were only three places I could fire that cannon, I don't know. Other than it being very timely at the time, I'm still not sure why that one uh, hijink is named after Mass Effect. What does the captain actually say? I was just following orders. It's not easy working for the Baron. I had little choice in regards to the children. Who's this? Ah, yes, ready to return to the train station. Are you sure you're ready to leave? A distinguished traveler would never leave so many things unfinished. Remember that many war many rewards await the determined. If you choose to leave, you can make a return visit at a later time to finish your accomplishments. Oh, man. Uh, I'm actually just missing broadsides, but... No, no, we should go. We should go. It's a quick trip. Oh, I guess I hit A and confirmed. 
Steamship docked. Grand adventurers incite mutiny. Baron says kids were free to leave. The Baron. He's on the turlet. I'm sorry about your steamship, my Baron, but this kid managed to... Oh, he's huge. Fuck me. A child did this? How is it that my men were bested by a child? He is tiny, Baron, but he has the power to bend others to his will. Oh, they do know. Keep an eye out for that little runt. If you see him, grab him. He's got the fanciest outfit I've ever seen. Uh, he's got medals all over his chest, and the doll inside of him appears to be another one of him. That's kind of crazy, isn't it? Ready for a return trip? Oh, I see. Board trip came to the uh, the Gilded Steamship. Oh, cutscene. Uh, oh, the messenger bird! What's the scroll say? Charlie, I can't wait to hear about your steamship adventure. Levi. I wonder if they've added hijinks to this level now. Levi, you're not going to believe what happened to the steamship! And the clock, showing time passing. And it turns out that my big sister Abigail is trapped on a Zeppelin! Charlie, the train to the Zeppelin isn't leaving until some VIP shows up and he's held up at the ticket lines. Time to solve another problem for the adults. Charlie, take this shortcut I found. Okay. The steamship sounded amazing. Oh, my mural does it justice. Oh, nice! It's actually a very solid depiction of it. Ah, uh, yes! All those paintings. And all those models. I love all the gl golden glow. Oh, interesting. Why is one of the old ones glowing? Odd. It's the guy with the drum. Yeah, so the paintings are of the caviar bucket that got dumped, the one that looks like a fish with a hat on. Uh, the pharaoh... Th the, uh, the half sar sarcophagus in a box. The one with the boxing gloves. Uh, the guy standing in front of the door of the club. That dude with the music player in his head in the map room, phonograph, that's the word. And one of the cardboard, and a picture of one of the cardboard tigers at the safari. Nice. I wonder the extra rewards were. For getting like the, uh... Oh, that's the mummy. Thought half of the paint was gone, but no, no, it's just the fact that it's covered in lines. Tap right bumper and follow the path through the shortcut to get to the ticket lines. There's just a fucking tunnel there! How did we not notice that? Wait, isn't this the same entrance we always had? Uh, uh. So maybe you really can only uh, do stacking if you're small enough to be the core. Ah, I see. This train car is actually shaped like a Zeppelin. That's silly. I don't know what the rightful difference between a Zeppelin and a blimp is, personally. Is that just the gas they use? It seemed to me they stopped using the term Zeppelin right around the time that uh, Zeppelin started exploding, because hi uh, hydrogen is very, very flammable. I've just realized I can actually see the gilded steamship in the distance. The cigars and the circus tent are a dead giveaway. Let me check something. Ooh, sort the lines. Oh, there are hijinks here! Damn! Soliciting, look both ways, you're it. A little relieved. A blast on the past. The Black Widow. Patronize. 
Bathroom Chatterbox, Rule of Law, an Uninvited Uppercut. But the punching guy was in the previous level. They didn't even have people of his size. Who the fuck are you? Have you heard the news? The Baron was followed by a child. I don't know who he was, but I'd like to thank him. It's time the Baron got knocked down a bit. Apparently this kid caused a mutiny. He's uh, a size one. Not a named person, though. What the fuck? No, 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 no. You get back here. It's one of the lion guys from uh, the safari. Rawr! What does this guy do? Those are paper. Baron is furious over mutiny. Read all about it. He's throwing newspapers at people. Extra, extra, mysterious child docks the gilded steamship. Extra, extra, unknown child outsmarts the Baron. Just the biggest fucking grin on Charlie right now inside of this guy. Hot off the presses, the Baron bested by a child. Read all about it. Gilded steamship returns to dock. New hijinks unlocked. Now that you're an experienced traveler, new hijinks have been unlocked in the train station. You can discover them by playing around or plus back and then left bumper to cycle to the hijinks tab for a complete link list. <laughs> well, let me take a look in the bathroom. God, a tall man just said, you should be cautious down there. Beat it, kid. Talk to dolls in the ba in both restrooms. Well, I might as well not be a complete lout about it. Uh, yeah, okay. I need to borrow you. Yes, hello, lady. Aren't you charming? Now leave! Wait, what turned gold because of that? Oh! The lady in the bathroom is now carrying a golden roll of toilet paper. Oh, wait, 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 wait. And so is the guy in the gentleman's. That's silly. None of the stalls are taken up, I'm just saying. You don't need to wait or anything, why are you just standing there with toilet paper in your hands? remember the things. Hey, there is a punchy man here. It's not really just punch people, is it? So maybe when I beat the last level, I uh, unlocked all those dudes here. These lines are outrageous! <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Where did it go? An uninvited uppercut. Oh, I know! This lounge, the club! Maybe the VIP room. If this doesn't work. Give dolls in the lounge a proper uppercut. Two. Three. Four. Five. And I once again have a golden glove. I guess that was the shortcut for uh, just breaking in. One of the newspapers is still rolling around on the floor. Because, of course, no one actually catches them. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you on the next episode of Let's Play Stacking when we continue our adventure and continue looking around here. Till then, have yourselves a great day, Burning Dog fans. Later.